Dim out TV, welcome to my humble abode. So yeah, I work at home. I work in a studio. I was going to the studio and do this. I mean, do another thing. Actually, I already did another thing. But this becomes the first because I forgot a sound file in the studio and the studio is so far away. So I'm doing a new one the same day as I'm putting it out. Yeah, and... Sometimes I get some questions and I often answer them backwards or like start at another end and it can get like really boring because I like to say the whole thing. It's pretty much why. So um, bear with me. Uh, I think uh, if, if you're into making music, you might find something uh, special in these demo TV sessions because uh, I come from a very free uh, place, and um, not everybody do, do, you know. So, okay, um, I got this song on the album, it's called um, All Went Down, and uh, it's a special tune, uh, because it's it's got this mystical vibe, and the chords really fucking complex on the on the verses and actually those chords were like really old I, I, I had them on a diskette but maybe um, we can get to that later on uh, but the chorus is what we're gonna take a look at so common question is how do you make music how do you build your songs or tunes and when I thought of it now it made me remember this old uh, children's comic in Bamsa and then there's this guy called Skalman and he has a, he drives a, a, a just one episode and at the end he, he drives a, a, a train uh, driven on lemonade and the the locomotive creates the the tracks that the, the train is riding on and so like in the same way you know uh, making music as you know you get these different ideas and it's about finding your way like making creating your way right and from just I mean, just give a tip like uh, there's one one method is to just jam and improvise and then you'll find these different elements you'll find a place and maybe it's one bar two bars uh, and y you you have to d listen to it and feel it and decide like is this something I want to build up to or is it just a place to be? You could be like the same bars for a whole song, mind you, of course. But that's not what we're talking about here. We're talking about a bit more of uh, composing. And so you have to decide, is this a place you want to go to? Some people might call it a center, I think. I think Stravinsky said something like that in a book I read. On a, it was one of his lecture called poetics or music or something but um yeah like e either it's a place you want to go to or it's a place that you want to start where you want to go from and then you have to find your way to these different places that you found and it's, you know it's hard sometimes you just can't get them together like you just have to give up but but that's really i think it's a fun part to try and find your way there and especially if you change the key a bit and then trying to find your way back to the original key that's um that's a bit of i i almost think that's a bit of a a, a, a composer's task to find that but that's just me okay so this particular song called all went down 
uh, I got the whole idea for the chorus just from these two chords. That's why I was talking about this. <clears throat> so, what it was, I just fell in love with this fucking chord made me want to write the chorus. Yeah, so just a short note. This here is like a digital piano, and I found a sound I read to it sounds okay. The original idea was on a real piano, acoustic, of course, and that had a really big sound. It was my grandmother's, my Swedish grandmother's sound. My Swedish grandmother, Aurora's piano. And, um, yeah, yeah. You're lucky if you have an instrument that really sounds nice, you know? Ah. Yeah, so... <clears throat> so, it got a bass line. Here's the bass line. And then um, the chords up here, here, oh, this is how it goes. So, you saw that end chord, I mean, um, the, the special chord. Um, I just made the, all the rest up to be able to do this. Okay, bye bye.